Hello YouTube! Welcome to Monique's Journey. It is December 31st. Happy old year. Um, yes, so I thought it would be a good time to uh, make a video. I didn't upload the last one I made because I made it on my other phone and it didn't have an automatic upload to YouTube and I got really lazy and now it seems kind of old. So <sighs> bye bye old video. Um, but I thought it was you know, really fitting. I know a lot of folks will go ahead and do a, you know, start thinking about New Year's resolutions or things like that. Um, you know, I, I really am. I'm only going to have one this year, which is every month I'm going to do something that puts me outside my comfort zone. So once a month, I will choose an activity that, um, that stretches me. You know, makes me stretch. I think maybe January I might even try thong underwear. Anyways, um, enough about what goes on in 2015. Uh, I thought it'd be a really good thing to talk about 2014. And, um, you know, here are the things I'm proud of. And I, I would like to challenge anybody else or, um, you know, lay it out there. Um, make up your own video, please. Please give me a response video. What are the things that you are super proud of? Um, in this past year. So, not necessarily in the right order, but uh, here we go. Um, yeah, I, I took the plunge and had surgery. That is, you know, to me, that is a huge accomplishment because I, it's a lot of things to, to, you know, that go into that, a lot of emotional processing and I, I made the decision a bit on a whim when it had surgery and um, definitely one of the best decisions of 2015. Another thing that I'm proud of is my fitness. So this morning, this morning, I, um, it was really cold at our house and I decided, um, you know, I woke up and I'm like, oh, okay, I'm going to hang out in bed a little bit before I go work out. I turned on the heater. I brought my workout clothes by the heater to warm them up and everything else and finally got dressed and I can head out to the gym and then I got three quarters of the way to the gym, realized I forgot my running shoes. I had to go back home, pick them up and go back again. And and as I was driving back to the gym, I realized, wow, like that's a huge change for me. That was a great, um, you know, a great eye opener. I, I, there were plenty of opportunities for me to go, oh, I'll go, I'll go another day. There were plenty of opportunities. It was cold. It was, um, you know, it was chilly. I didn't bring my shoes. I was feeling a little tired. I had plenty of excuses, but I didn't bail. And that is something that I'm super duper proud of. I, um, what else? I did, uh, oh, I did a million step challenge. That was pretty cool. Um, I've changed the way I eat. Um, I will put, uh, I, I, uh, if you've seen some previous videos, I put containers in, um, one cup containers. I take my protein with me. Um, and I, uh, I package my snack. I have packed my lunch every day, um, since I started working here and pretty much post-surgery, I have packed my lunch every day except for two days where I knew explicitly three, sorry, three days where I knew explicitly that we were going to go out to eat prior to that. So that is something that I, I didn't think fathomable. Um, hmm, what else? I have let go of a lot of things. I, um, I am embracing myself more. I definitely have opportunity there, but trying to be more positive with my self-talk. I um, try to get myself out there a lot more. I took a new job this year. That was a big step. I went to El Salvador on a trip there uh, with uh, Habitat Global Village. That's another really cool thing. I got a dog. There you go. Proud to have that for 2015, 2014. I'm sure there are probably several other things, but those are just 
the highlights that I have for this year. So I'm inviting all my YouTube followers and my Facebook friends to make your own video. What are the things that you are proud of for 2015? Let's 2014. Let's celebrate what an amazing year it's been and um, not put as much pressure on those things of 2015 the resolutions uh, they will come you know we'll set goals I'm setting myself goals as opposed to these um, big broad resolutions and I encourage everybody else to do the same so with that I will see you next year Take care and be as kind to yourself as you are to others and have a wonderful evening. Bye.